In many cultures, blinking or twitching of the eyes is associated with certain positive and negative outcomes. Blinking of the eyes is, in fact, used to foretell events in countries like India, China, Africa, and Hawaii. Predictions vary according to the gender of the person concerned and whether it's the right or left eye. Sometimes, the time it occurs has a bearing on the interpretation too, though it is not so in Indian astrology. In a few cultures, the blinking of the right eye is said to be the harbinger of death, especially of a close relative. Some people believe that right eye blinking indicates that someone is praising the person, or that the person may receive some good news. It could also indicate an unexpected encounter with someone. Blinking of right eye for men in India, when a man's right eye blinks or twitches, it is said to be auspicious. It usually signifies that the man will hear some good news related to his career. It can spell good fortune and a good future. Blinking of right eye for women for women, right eye blinking is a bad omen. They may hear some bad news about their career. They may also face all kinds of problems in their lives. Eye blinking according to time The meaning of the eye blinking depends on the timing too. Thus, if the right eye blinks between 6 am to 5 pm, the person may receive an invitation. If the blinking happens between 5 pm and 6 am, a tragedy might befall the person. Eye blinking in Chinese culture The Chinese have their own beliefs about eye blinking or twitching. They believe that if the left eyelid of a man blinks or twitches, it heralds good fortune, while the blinking of the right eyelid indicates bad luck. In the case of women, right eye blinking or twitching means good fortune, while left eye blinking or twitching is not a good sign. Some also say that twitching in the lower left eyelid means that one may weep early or that someone is gossiping about you. Eye blinking in African culture in some regions of Africa, if the lower eyelid twitches, it means that the person will weep in the near future. If the upper eyelid twitches, the person will meet someone unexpectedly. Eye blinking in Hawaiian culture in Hawaii, Eye blinking may mean the arrival of an outsider or someone's death. Some believe that frequent blinking of the left eye indicates a downfall in the family, while blinking of the right eye suggests the imminent birth of a child. In Vietnam, blinking of both eyes is considered a sign of trouble. In Vietnam, blinking of a man's eye is considered a sign of trouble, and blinking of a woman's eye is considered a sign of relief. Eye blinking or twitching happens often and is not usually a cause for worry. It is normally short-lived, but if the blinking persists for long, it may indicate a neurological condition and may need to be investigated by an eye doctor. Excessive blinking or twitching of the eyes can be the result of extreme eye fatigue due to watching TV or working on the computer for a long time, or excessive use of the mobile phone, etc. If the eye blinking or twitching continues for more than three days, one should see a doctor. In our body, the interconnection of muscles and bones is very strong and interconnected. Similarly, the protective roof over the eye, called the eyelid, eyelid, also receives electrical energy from the same nervous transmission system and completes the process of blinking. Simply put, our brains supply an electric charge to all the muscles in our brain, with the help of which our muscles do their job. For example, we hold something, walk. The movement of the legs and arms, the blinking of the eyes, the closing of the eyes, respectively, are subject to the same electrical conduction that is provided by the primary grid station, the brain. If this supply is reduced, or stopped, all these processes take place. Stop partially or completely the electrical power supplied by the brain is moderate and precise. If there is a shortage, excess, or interruption in this supply, the musculoskeletal system is affected. And constant unavailability of electricity is a precursor to disease. A decrease in this electrical transmission results in weakness. 
Lack of electrical power causes paralysis. Similarly, if there is an abnormal increase in this electrical transmission, the organs connected to these muscles start working very fast. Excessive electrical conduction usually causes epilepsy. If the electrical supply to the eye muscles is supplied in large quantities, then the eye begins to blink. Although blinking is not a precursor to pain or damage, but it can cause mental confusion and anxiety. This process is limited to a few seconds to a few minutes. Sometimes this process does not happen again for a whole week. And sometimes it lasts for several weeks. If this is a minor issue, you should try to avoid it. If it is persistent and excessive, medical advice from a neurologist is essential. In order to eliminate the possibility of epilepsy. Other factors that work behind the process of blinking of the eyes, coffee, tea, and alcohol consumption is also high. Consumption of these hot and cold drinks increases the amount of caffeine in our body. Other common factors that cause eye puffiness include mental stress, eye irritation, eyelid tension, fatigue, sleep, deficiency, physical exertion, side effects of medications, it is important to keep in mind that alcohol, tobacco, and caffeine levels can cause eye strain, salivation, inflammation, conjunctivitis, dry sun, bright light, and environmental pollution. If the blinking of the eye is more than normal, then it is necessary to get rid of the superstitions and seek treatment from any medical professional. Otherwise, dangerous diseases can arise. Some of the notable ailments are, facial paralysis, limb twisting, neck and head stiffness, nervous breakdown, tremor, and convulsions. Medical science discusses all of these factors, as well as our dietary irregularities or related food intolerances. Magnesium, hemp leaves and flowers, zinc, babchi, and many other such natural ingredients play a very effective role in the treatment of this disease. Consistent use of spinach, potatoes, beans, dates, almonds, pistachios, cashews, green onions, peanuts, fresh red peppers, lentils, etc. in fruits and vegetables and complete avoidance of tea, coffee, and other artificial beverages. Can save nervous stress, depression, confusion, anxiety, are also the main causes of this disease. Therefore, to look at it from the point of view of superstition, and to associate destiny and destiny with it, is nothing but meaningless and ignorant. We make some wrong and hasty decisions because of mental anxieties, and we act without thinking, which cause losses. It is a misconception to compare these losses with the blink of an eye. It is a regular medical disease. Therefore, medical and psychological methods should be adopted to cure it. Neurophysiologists Ophthalmologists, psychiatrists, and nutritionists will be a very useful tool and a wise step in this disease. It is ignorance to equate general health problems and bodily abnormal movements with destiny, and to form an opinion about the future in the light of these movements. The functioning of the nervous system, respiratory system, liver, etc. should be taken into consideration the simpler the human life and the freer the mind, the happier, healthier and more comfortable life will be. Superstitions are a deadly poison to human, religious, and social beliefs. The root causes of most of our medical problems are unwarranted fashion, constant pursuit of luxuries and luxuries, intolerance, and lack of communication in relationships, and mutual quarrels. These are the problems that plague us with various medical conditions. And then instead of treating these ailments, we look at them through the lens of superstition, and instead of curing them, we create a form of affliction for ourselves. It is wise to abandon superstitions and seek the help of physics. The Lord of the Universe has diagnosed eye puffiness, circadian pain, abdominal pain, body aches, dry lips, widening of the eyes, dark circles under the eyes, whitening of the nails, premature graying of the hair, cold, cough, and so on. 
Thousands of symptoms are managed so that doctors can use the symptoms to help diagnose and treat the disease. These signs are blessings, not troubles. Without these symptoms, a disease would never go through a diagnosis and treatment. These symptoms are extremely important for any physician. These symptoms should be considered a natural means of diagnosing the disease and naming superstitions is not rational or consciously correct. According to the website Viral Nova, medical experts say that the two main causes of cataracts can be depression and lack of sleep. There is also a link between stress and lack of sleep. It's because of stress that you stay up all night and can't get enough sleep. In this case, the blink of an eye indicates that you need more rest. You can make the necessary changes in your lifestyle to get rid of stress or you can consult a specialist psychologist for guidance. Excessive pressure on the eyes can also be a cause of puffiness. Nowadays our lifestyle is such that in the office we stare at the computer screen for a long time and then we also spend a lot of time staring at the screen of our mobile phone. When our eyes are focused on the screen of a computer or mobile phone for such a long time, they get tired. In this case, the blink of an eye sends a message that your eyes need a break and rest. Consult a physician if you wear goggles as you may need to change or if you do not wear goggles you may find out after a doctor's examination that you need them. Be especially careful not to use your mobile phone too much before going to bed as the light coming out of its screen does not make you fall asleep quickly and does not make you sleepy. Also, the causes of cataracts include excessive smoking and an unbalanced diet. If you do not find any other negative things in your lifestyle, then you must consider these two things and especially ensure the use of a balanced diet.